the topic of this video is what most men are interested in most guys are interested in and they really want to know about it i made a video about hymen where i said that the hymen is not the determinant of a virgin the hymen doesn't really tell if a lady is a virgin or not and i got some questions saying okay how do you know that a lady has slept with a lot of men then i decided to answer this question with a short video all right welcome back my name is nurse Mess mary popularly known as a nurse with the difference and i make learning easy and accessible for all my viewers today i'm going to be sharing with you five signs that a lady has slept with a lot of men see the number five point is going to shock you trust me when i say that but before i die for that if you are new on our youtube channel and you have not clicked on that subscribe button please click on that subscribe button Turn on that notification bell so you don't miss out. So now let me go back to the point. The first point I have to share with you that a lady has slept with a lot of men is she is never satisfied. Yes, a lady that has had different encounters with different men will be difficult to be satisfied on bed. Why? Because she had had different experience with different sizes, long large small extra large extra extra large and now you are coming with either medium or small definitely she's not going to be satisfied um she has also had experience with those that have lasted longer that has lasted for 30 minutes one hour 15 minutes 10 minutes and now you are just coming with two seconds definitely she is not going to be satisfied so that is why having different partners sex partners having multiple sex partner has a role to play when it comes to relationship has a role to play when it comes to um satisfaction sexually as a lady so a lady that has multiple sex partner will be difficult for her to be sexually satisfied then the other points i have to share with you which is the second one is that she's extremely good in bed yes she had experience you can't tell me that somebody that has not had sex all of a sudden you're having sex for the first time and you are extremely good in bed see for a cook to be extremely good the cook has to cook consistently to be perfect in escapes right for a cleaner to be good in the job the cleaner has to do the work consistently to be perfect in this for, to be perfect in that cleaning to know oh this is a quicker way to go about it for a nurse to be good the nurse has to have a good amount of experience to be good same way for a woman to be extremely good in bed she must have had good and wonderful experience she must have had like different sex partners to be good in bed and the third point i have to share with you is that she feels so insecure yes like she's always scared that oh when you're on phone she's like oh who is this man on phone with now is he on phone with another girl is he on phone with another because she had other experiences of people having sexual intercourse with her and breaking her heart having sexual intercourse with her and leaving her she had experiences of men talking about cheating on her girlfriends she had, she had even experienced it so most of the time she will feel insecure like oh this particular person, this particular man might be cheating on me. This particular man might break my heart. Any small thing, she's like, she's she's reactive. She's reactive to all your actions and she's suspicious of your movement. Then the fourth one I have to share with you is that she gets intimate on her first date. She gets intimate on her first date. What do I mean by that? The first time if people are coming in contact, like having the first date, she can like i want to have sex with you at the end of the day people end up having sex which is not right because a lady who has not been having sex before who has not been sleeping with a lot of people when they see you for the first it will be difficult for her to just fully release her body for you to go intimate even kisses might be difficult to even get into but if a lady has been having frequent sex like regularly it will be difficult to like it's easy to get intimate on the first date then the fifth point I have to share with you, whether you like it or not, to know that a lady has slept with a diff, like with a lot of men. This is the only stamp that is accurate is if she tells you, yeah, if she opens up and tells you, oh, I personally, I have slept with a lot of men. Then you have to know that that is it. You get that's the only like she only like it's the only person that can confirm how many men she has slept with she has slept with a lot of men she has slept with few men she has slept with only one man she's the only person that can confirm it and for those waiting for me to say loose vagina hmm i'm not going to say that as a stamp like a loose vagina is a sign that a lady 
has slept with a lot of men because there is no research backing that up and i'm not coming here to tell you that that is it because um the social media is saying a loose vagina signifies that a lady has slept with a lot of men there are some ladies that have just slept with one man like they hardly have sex back to back but the nature of their vagina is loose why some they have slept like they have had a lot of sexual experience sexual encounter but their vagina is still tight and it's not loose and also when we talk about looseness it also depends on what is going into that's what is penetrating the lady so if a uh, a small size dick is actually penetrating the lady definitely it's going to look loose to the person having sex with that lady at that particular time but you know a loose vagina is not a determinant if a lady has slept with a lot of men or not because i have not seen any research backing that up but if you get a research that has backed that up please and please let me know because i will likely and joyfully read it but the society says that a loose vagina is but to me i want to ask you this question what is your take on it if you've had experiences and you would like to share kindly drop in the comment section i would like to learn from you but these are the five points i have to share with you to know that a lady has slept with a lot of women the most important point is to ask her if you are so inquisitive and she gives you a yes or a no answer thank you very much for staying tuned thank you very much for watching this video don't forget to like don't forget to subscribe and also don't forget to share with a friend if you got value for all my returning subscribers this is not very saying thank you bye and see you in our next video